So now we're going to attempt regluing that piece to this piece so it stays solid. <clears throat> Tools needed. Thin little piece of uh, toilet paper. Like about that thin. Just enough wide enough to wrap around that broken that broken uh, crease or just around the surround the crack. Just enough to surround around a crack like that. Further tools needed. Crazy glue. Baking powder. Dispense from a uh, brush pick, uh, tool pick, tool, uh, or brush, brush picks, like toothpicks. Little hole on top of there. You can uh, sprinkle it on. Little uh, duster. Lens cleaning kit. Lens cleaning kit from Amazon. You brush off all the dust. You see what I mean in a second. So let's get started. Also, you're gonna need some kind of toothpicks, plastic or something plastic and thin that you can mat down the glue with. Has to be plastic, cause otherwise it'll stick to the glue. The plastic for some reason doesn't stick. All right, let's get it. <clears throat> First you want to tack it on with the super glue. Preferably a brush because the pen style uh, grazy glue you don't have this kind of uh, I don't know dexterity so you tack it on keep applying it all around till all the paper is moistened with the crazy glue Alrighty, it's starting to get hard for some reason. Turn it around, see what I'm doing. Also, it's helpful that you have a pan of ice. As you can see, the JB Weld glue on top of the pan of ice. These are little neodymium magnets, JB welded to the pan of ice. Onto, you know, me, uh, steel surface. Yeah, it's already starting to get hard. Take my little fucking toothpick. Yeah, whatever. Any, anywhere you see dry toilet paper, you want to dab with the crazy glue. See right there. See how that plastic piece, plastic toothpick doesn't adhere to this crazy glue for some reason. That, that I messed up on. Oh well, it's too late now. I let it dry before I matted it down. So now it's gonna have a little sharp edge on there. As you can see. Crazy glue, a little more. 
Make sure that ring doesn't stick, which it is. I don't think so. Alright, that's good enough. Now, as you can tell, it's still wet. How do you rectify that? Voila. Baking powder. Baking soda. Take it out of the vise. Remove this vise. Ahem. <clears throat> You see this? There's still a little more dry toilet paper in there. It might seem like overkill, but you really got to get this toilet paper moist and damp from the crazy glue. You could just leave it like that, but it takes forever for it to dry. I don't have that. I don't have that fucking kind of time. So, baking powder dispensed through brush picks, the dispenser toothpick container. Just lightly, lightly go in. Don't matter if you doesn't matter if you spill. All that excess shit's gonna come off. Take your little toothpick. Make sure you get all the dust and shit all over that wetness from the fucking uh, wet toilet or the damp toilet paper with the crazy glue. This light. It's a lot of glare. Too much glare. Yeah. Yeah, make sure you don't touch that wet toilet and that damp toilet paper. It's going to stick all over you and shit. Anything that hits that toilet paper that's not plastic, thin plastic, it's going to stick. See how this baking powder, it's drying it out. It's drying out all that damp uh, toilet paper. Just get it all over. See how you can dispense it very little amounts. It's still messy, but it's better than just dumping it on there. Just want to get all that dust to dry that toilet paper. See, it's not sticky. If you didn't put that dust on there, that baking powder, you'd still be waiting there another 20, 30 minutes, an hour, until that paper dries up. All right. A little, whatever, lens cleaner, duster. Get all the excess dust off there. Everywhere else. Fucked up. See, no stick. Get all up. Excess dust everywhere else. Normally I wouldn't have done it like this, but this damn key's so hard to take off with all the other fucking keys on there, so I said fuck it. Just put it in the pan of ice, some kind of vice, C clamp, whatever. Yeah, that's good enough. Fuck it. <clears throat> now, what do we have? Still kinda damp. 
It's not... Need a little time for that shit to fucking... You can hear it crack just a little bit. Hey. Needs a little more time for curing. But for the most part, that's fucking rigid. Give it another 24 hours. It'll be solid. As you can see, there's no sticking from this crazy glue. Let me see. Shit. Fuck. Well, it did break a little. Guess that wasn't enough to hold it. Guess you need a little more, uh, this little crevice right here where it's snapped into. Yeah. Put a little piece of toilet paper in there. Take your glue out. Tack it in with the glue. I don't put any don't put any baking powder in here. Cause it'll dry up immediately. So Alright, then what I'm gonna do is uh give it another wrapping. All the reason before I had an invent device was that it uh this part was it wasn't Stand, but since it's already tacked in there with my previous mishap, as you can see, it's sticking to the fingers real good. Only reason it snapped because I did a stress test on the fucking thing and snapped. Should just let it be for 24 hours. I'm going to see what happens. I put that other piece of... As you can see, it causes a mess, but, oh well, you want your shit fixed, right? And, get the fucking, just take it off in the garbage can. Get all that excess dust off. That's all I did. It's dry. I don't know. I'm not gonna touch it again. Before I tested it, snapped because I didn't have the, I didn't have the glue and the paper inside that crack. Before I just had it wrapped around. But this time I have it wrapped around and inside the crack, glue and toilet paper. I don't know. I'm afraid to st stress test it. Seems pretty solid though. Seems pretty solid. Oh well, that's it. As you can see, let it dry a little. It's not 24 hours, about 5 minutes. But, I don't know, it seems pretty solid to me. That glue might still be wet in that crack, so I'm afraid to fucking do it real hard, but. I 
I don't know, after 24 hours should be fully cured. I don't hear any. I don't hear any, like, flexing. So maybe that crack, that paper in the crack, you know, cured already. Oh, well, that's it.